important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. You sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. It is good to see you, B. Seems pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? Look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at anchor in the bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. Just hope he doesn't blindly follow Arasaka protocol. What protocol? Unwritten rules. <laughs> Had him here in Night City. Could be different in Japan. If IA got even a whiff of treason, they prep an enhanced interrogator and send two elite squads with air support to grab the suspect. I understand the point you seek to make. But if Oda has ulterior motives, he will need no elites, no air support, no one but himself. Trust me, I have seen him walk. <laughs> That's supposed to be reassuring. If it helps you stay calm, you can gaze at the sky. By God, huh? A good sign. He is usually camouflaged. Takemura-san. Oda. Is this him? Your thief. He's my witness, B. Can't speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Not gonna like what I'm about to say. I need a guarantee I'm safe here. 
You are, you have it. B, you can trust Oda. All right then. Compeki Plaza. I was there the night it happened. Looked like your typical family quarrel until... Yorinobu lunged at Saburo and started choking. Silence! Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my But you can't to... ignore the truth. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it. Sorry, but is this gonna take much longer? I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your noble summer. What would you do now? Were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu Sama. Consider yourself Raki. That I Oda, am not... you are an Arasaka soldier. This is not a request. We remind you of your duty to be truthful to your superiors. I did not come here to be lectured to by a thief. Wasn't always what I am now. And your friend here didn't always look like a bum. Feel free to join us. Plenty of room at the bottom of the heap. Not enticed? Then do your duty. Tell Hanago what nobody else wants to hear. That should be to him. As you say, food of all thought. Just gotta tell it like it is sometimes. It is a shame. Nothing will come of it. How come? It should have been obvious. Oda is a perfectionist. He most fears to make a mistake. Good fucking riddance. One hour soccer whack job is already plenty. No way this is gonna work. Mm, yet. We walk away with a small measure of success. Hmm. How do you figure that? What Oda said. They returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see the parade? It is our chance, perhaps. If, somehow, we can get to Hanako-sama, we must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan Town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Uh, hang on. Not so fast. It could sound as easy as hacking a schism. You said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. No, just the fixer dame. Wakaku Akata runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Will you join me? Sure, why not? JJ Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a Night City name. Beware, you mock me too often. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorinobu and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile, 
the bigger the lies. You all right, Goro? Yes. Why the sudden concern? <laughs> I'm just asking. Does everything with you have to have an ulterior motive? I apologize. That came off wrong. I... am... I am simply not used to such questions. People like me, either we are doing well, or we are in a grave. has a wicked vibe. Got something that'll keep you hard for hours. Understanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. Well, well, who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Bukako, long time no see. So what? brings you here. And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together. That's all. Takemura Goro desu. Okada-san, oai dekite kohei desu. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, oh, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V. Bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Would have already made the call if you intended to. Simple. You're curious to see what we got. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka again. What I fail to understand is why come to me? Did Mr. Deshawn not come to the phone?
Come on. Got your finger on the hood's pulse. Know everything. Parade honoring Saburo Arasaka? You're prepping in some way, no doubt. Won't see me dressed in mourning. Iwanante. But the rest is true. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? For free? You sure? Got my reasons, but patience, I got none. Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, the guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old, automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Not at all curious what we're going to all this trouble for. Blissful ignorance has served me well. In any case, I'll find out soon, won't I? Thanks, Wukako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. I was saying something. A delightful, mature woman. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Stay safe, Goro. You as well. Until next time. Hey, look. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Yeah. More likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both.
I saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? I grabbed a scan. Take a look. Taro. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. I the what now? Major Arcanum? Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. Either way, you're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand, from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road. So go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Things. Get you anything? Could definitely go for a drink. Tough day? Well, like any other. So, what'll it be? This trouble? The net around me? You wove it. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean Do up you know your what, own Will? shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Rogue. Wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. The girl? What was her gripe? Why didn't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells. T-Bug. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our socket tower, before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. 
Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day? No. More like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm-hmm. Then see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. Information from Okada-san. Very valuable. I also learned something through my own efforts. We must meet. Where will it be this time? Trash processing plant? Deserted end cart station? In the south of Japan town, there is a street market. It is on the footbridge above the main street. Use the elevators. It is easy to get lost. I am on my way there. Do not make me wait. World Report. I'm Jillian Jordan. Scientists from Biodyne Systems have announced a breakthrough in the fight against... I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Zoot no right. Oh, perfect timing. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Yorinobu's a smart little muffin. Putting on the parade to show off his attachment to Arasaka, its values, and to solidify his legitimacy. He is true. I will not deny that. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and I will see in them a hidden message to his force. What message would that be? I am here, Kumin Domo. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, 
Find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shot. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Where'd you get this shot? Across the canal. Kabuki? <laughs> Might actually be half-decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. Let us move on. To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Think I see where this is going. Got me doing all the dirty work. Do you wish to trade places? What exactly would you say to her? Hello, my name is V. Hanako-sama knows me. Only I can do this. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. B? Fucking worked. And done. System's ours. The shot works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. Bridge we might cross, but only might, we'll see. Glad we're on the same page. You never know what a dog's thinking. Might be the same thing. What is this? Hey! 
Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. your elaborate seppuku ritual? What? Why? As far as I can see, you're trying to get us killed. Really like to know why. The risks are substantial, yes. But we have no choice. Hanako-sama is our only chance. You have nothing to lose, as I do. I see it in your eyes. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let him off his leash. I'm let a stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Cook! Louder! Louder! I have decided to you know the amount. In the flesh. Night City security forces. President Myers has he eliminated the last obstacle the between Corps. himself and the complete power. The they surrendered it to him. Tell me that. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. Old man's death must have really fed the flames between the different factions. That is exactly what happened. And what's the balance of power look like now? Kiji longs for stability. The old order. They are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato. Support Michiko-sama. Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka. Treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. If we tell me about them some other time. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could've kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Wait. Think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think we are all to blame. We allowed ourselves to be tricked. But we will correct this soon. Will you join me?
Sure, why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. Since we're gonna work together, only way oh, to say hello. They call me El Capitan, and they call you B. See, no introductions necessary. I already took care of that. Someone comes to me with biz, I take care of it. I eat, sleep, and breathe biz. Remember that. Aye, aye, Captain. While we're at it, you need fresh wheels, bikes? I got it all. Real good prices. So hit me up any time, you hear? We must just climb up here. <sighs> now, this way. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much. Hmm, perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Oh, can you run and grab some pizza? Take out the food? No. Just no. If I had time and ingredients, I would prepare some onigiri with cod or with grilled salmon. No, even better, with umeboshi plums. Mmm, Arasaka sama's favorite appetizer. Simple, tasty, and filling. I found him chewing once. Pride on his face. It was a protein bar. Subaru Arasaka with a protein bar? Get out of here. Like a true soldier. Okay, enough. Or well, we'll both grow hungry. Let's do this. Pipes. See him? We can 
to use them to get inside. Antenna. Security hub is liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. Got eyes in the comms system. There's a lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. This is not bad. Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So, we going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in then. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a back and echo. Back and echo? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune, can restore the dead back to life. Even ghosts? The relic let you talk to the dead, does it not? I believe we are past belief. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko too. Where'd you grow up anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. What was it like growing up in Chiba 11? I remember the chemical stench of the canal. Where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. Transporters, you say? Armored and armed. Chiba 11 has the most murders in all Japan. It probably still has. What did they need kids for? To be corporate soldiers. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. So how's a corpo rookie go from cleaning latrines to being Saburu Arasaka's bodyguard? The highest grades at the academy, serves in the special forces, and Arasaka-sama's unmatched eye for talent. You're not saying Saburo fell for you at first sight. 
to make the right decisions with imperfect knowledge. That is how you become the world's most powerful man. 100 candidates standing at attention. And Arasaka-sama looked into each of our souls and chose the one who would serve him best. All you had to do in return was kill Saburo's enemies. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Saying you got no dirt on your hands? There are no clean hands, but it is important how they become dirty. So Spill, how'd you sully yours? Arasaka gave me what no one else could. Values I could honor, live for. This was most important. You dirty your hands for money. I, in the name of principles. Wasn't judging you. And true, you oppose the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world and its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists. As if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability, safety... The Chiba 11 slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that too. We cannot fix everything at once. Forgetting I was at Arasaka, saw how corps operate. It wasn't roses and rainbows. And you know what? Nobody owns me. I'm free. You should try it. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world. Forget everything. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompeki, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this. So we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Finally started to make some sense. There's one thing you should know. It is about Mr. Wells. About Jack? What is it? When I set out to find you, others went to find Jackie. They took his body. For the life of me can't figure why. So his mom couldn't give him a proper send-off? Arasaka has a method for playing information from the dead. What are you talking about? Don't ask for details. I understand little. I know they use the Soul Killer program to do so. They can pull an engram from Wells' body. Damaged. Incomplete. But still an engram. Motherfuckers. Evil. Jackie's psyche, where are they keeping it? This, I do not know. Why am I only hearing this now? I did not know I could trust you. The circumstances have changed. The Baganenko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. I think it is time to do something, hmm? Oh, 
fuck get worse? You do not look so bad. I'll be in touch. The diversionary action, that is mine to do. I mean, good. Now try to enter the warehouse. I will draw their attention. Now.
find the largest float. They are controlled from inside. The tech, it could be an ordinary terminal. Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I will reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. But when you finish, I'll make the system sick.
did you stand a chance? Huh? Boat's ours to do with as we please. You can fly to Tokyo if you want. Ha <laughs> ha! I just may do that. Good work. Now it is my turn. Can you see? The roof kills. Even the roof is slowly. Me! The roof! That is your will! There are buildings around. Smaller ones. Use them to come down. What now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. As if I wasn't in enough already. <laughs> <laughs> 